What you're listening to are musicians performing psychedelic music under the influence of a mind-altering chemical called LSD. What you're hearing now is the hysterical laughter of a young man shaken by a wild hallucination midway through an LSD trip. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy right where I am right now. Right where I am, I'm so happy. Millions of Americans will illegally consume lysergic acid diethylamide, commonly known as LSD, during the next 12 months. Such indiscriminate use of LSD, once solely intended for scientific research, has snowballed into a nationwide crisis. Teenagers prowl along the Sunset Strip in Los Angeles, high on the drug. Some of them chew the bark off trees and growl like dogs. They alternately writhe on the floor, screaming, cower in a corner, or dreamily prop themselves against the walls. 10,000 thrill-seekers attend a three-day LSD festival in San Francisco, undulating to atonal music while experiencing way-out trances. LSD pushers openly sell the drug on dozens of college campuses. Adherents include corporation presidents, noted educators, a magazine publisher, 